you could just kind of tell us what led you to uh, to us uh, as far as your needs for a network monitoring platform such as Live Action? Well, uh, I first saw it at my previous job, and I, I liked the demo so much that when I came to my new job, I really wanted to use it too. And we had a, uh, a big project coming up. We were moving uh, to a brand new building. We built a new headquarters. Um, and having that tool available uh, really helped us resolve a number of issues with QoS we ran into both in uh, how some of the equipment we were using was set up, uh, stripping QoS markings, and how our WAN providers were uh, either remarking or, or not putting us in the right queues. Um, so we used it um, right after the move, was able to you know follow a flow, pick a phone, and see, okay, well, you know, we're doing 46 all the way until we hit this switch. This switch doesn't trust, it's dropping the markings. Um, and that that was probably the best use I got out of it, or at least the one I used the most, because, you know, trying to go from device to device, let me look at my policy map, let me see how my markings are, um, it's a pain. But having that topology view and being able to, you know, see my color-coded flow, you know, oh, here it just went from yellow to blue, okay, well, there's my DSCP change, uh, and that's where my problem is. And that was just a, a huge, huge time saver. The topology view uh, has been great for, you know, if my boss or my CIO comes up to me, wants a shoulder surf, and asks me what the problem is, for me to be able to show him visually, okay, you know, here's the flow, here's this device in this location, uh, here's where the problem is, it makes that interaction, that interpretation a lot easier, yeah, okay. and especially with the QoS management yeah. too. I mean, that's, I mean, having to go through and, you know, blow away whole policy maps when you just want to change the bandwidth reservation for, you know, one item, um, being able to do that uh, is just amazing. I'm surprised that, uh, you know, it's taken so long to get something like this that lets you, you know, just point and click and reserve what you want uh, as opposed to, you know, the granularity involved in going through CLI just to make simple policy changes. Like, that's a huge time to Okay. What are some of the... Um, the drivers then that you see that are differentiators with the live action tool versus some of the other products that are on the market? Um, the, the biggest driver for when we first got it um, is not many products have the topology view. Like they don't have the ability to to visualize that flow from end to end so I can see exactly you know where that flow is changing or what's happening to it. Um, that was a big sell to me. And then again, I mean I know I already hit on the QoS, but the, the ease of the QoS management, um, I mean that that sold it to me out of the box. I mean that was it.